welcome to St. Lucia Experience, recorded here on St. Lucia Beaches by Petrus Vivius and his favorite beach partet. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Yes, it's Petrus Vivius here at the St. Lucia History Mouth, bringing your morning beach walk to you. What have we got going today? We'll have to wait and see. Yes guys, this beautiful jacket is a made by Rattle clothing, ocean or boat clothing. They do lots and lots of things uh, for boats and ski boats. You can find the contact details in the description below. Or you can contact me if you want to support the channel with by getting your extreme boating jacket. Just look at that. Let me flip some photos yeah I'm so proud of this jacket thank you for watching guys and thank you for subscribing please remember to share we need a wider range of audience more international people it will benefit the community and the channel a lot yo sure, look at this mud bank over here I hope it forms a rock this mud bank can mortify that will be good for the estuary mouth management that mud bank is clearly responsible for the formation of this square bay that is forming here at the estuary mouth beautiful <laughs> i love it but we're gonna need some management for sediment management in the future nature is not going to be this patient with us much longer ek het lang gewag hier voor meneer Goliath baie baie dankie wow dis prachtig what a beautiful footage of the Goliath heron eating a tilapia quite a sizable one he's breaking the bones inside the tilapia softening it up Waited for weeks for you to feed. Wow. Patience is a virtue. Little bit big for you. Little bit ambitious. Down the hatch it goes. Ah. We was close to the shore this morning to get closer and see if I can get better footage of them tide coming in strongly mud banks are filling up with the water quickly either some displays of dominance going on or some mating going on So sorry for the people that can't be uh, helping us 
thinning the shad population because there's way too many of them in the ocean but it's fine guys you keep them on the bite for you if you can come this weekend if you can't uh, we'll see if we will get them on the bite again for you for next weekend Galen Albert and Wiseman fishing there's somebody um, that's using double whoops that doesn't want to be on the video they just pulled out these two shads so I can't pan more to the left for those that they wonder why and Wiseman is on Wiseman has got a shad and he's bringing in it slowly and he's taking his time and is he gonna land it yes Wiseman landed the shad I had to sacrifice my shad rod for the gentleman on the right to to fish on video it's a cheap rod reel but that's what I had to do and Wiseman has got another shad don't lose it Wiseman oh it's too small Wiseman is putting it back must be too small Kaylin has got another shed beautiful also too small guys are working hard but they're catching shed one plus caught one Wiseman has got two Kalen got one and one undersized that he returned Al Albert is hooking the people's lines Wiseman is hooking people's lines Kalen just cast it See how Wiseman keeps the, his rod tip high now he's now pulling it in down it's looking for the depth that the shad is feeding on oh. Weissman missed it throw off the throw and then they still only get the undersized ones nothing yet that's quite edible see the techniques the guys are using Mantla's keeping his rod low he's got the biggest shad so far of the four people that is um, on my screen time and Wiseman looks like if he might be in. Nope, it was a miss. And this is irritating the shit out of Mandla. He, he, he's a one, one cost shared guy type of guy. Oh, Kalen threw over everybody's lines and he corrects the problem, keeps on fishing. See guys, you stand straight, straight over your cast. You don't cast skew and wait for your skew cast to come back to you. You correct yourself, you go where you cast, you go and move your body to that point to be a straight line between you, your sinker or your lure. That's how it works. The rules of the beach, the rules of the road.
Island look like you got another at the size one. Mandla has got to stand at the different spot. There's no more fish in this spot. Hi guys, if you're not subscribed to the channel yet, please click on the photo of me and Pardet and you'll be subscribed. It's absolutely for free. YouTube don't charge you a cent. That I don't charge you a cent. Everything is for free if you subscribe. So it helps sustain me and Pardet in St. Lucia and improve our quality of life. Thank you.